hello everyone in today's video i am going to show you guys about how you can create automatic skirting for your walls as when you place the walls the skirting is placed automatically but before we start let me remind you to like and share my videos leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel and also if you have any kind of difficulty you can ask me anytime so now let's start the tutorial open a new family template file for the profile click ok and here I am going to draw the profile for the skirting that is basically the section of the uh, skirting so here I have downloaded this image from the internet and you can design any type of uh, section any type of profile for the skirting and here i'm going to draw this one the og yogi whatever that type of profile so just simply draw with the help of uh, draw toolbox the lines and the arcs and once you have this enclosed loop which is shown with the blue lines just save this file and load it into the project for that i have opened a new architectural template file and once you have opened it simply load it into the project and close it stay on the floor plan and select the wall command now as you can see when i have placed the the walls it does not contains any skirting so open this dialog box click on preview and here you can see the floor plan click here and now you can see the vertical section of the wall here to open more of its properties click on edit and now you have this dialog box where you can see that when you are in the plans in the horizontal section these uh, commands are not visible but when you are in the sectional view the sweep command is visible then click on sweep and new dialog box appears and then click on add and select the profile for the skirting which you have loaded into the project file selected with from here you can change the uh, assign the material to the skirting you want and you can give it any type of material you wish for let's give it this this material and click ok and from here you can change the distance you can see this little skirting which is visible from here and from here you can change its distance of the vertical distance at which you want it from the base of the wall and this is where you want it either on the interior side of the wall or the exterior side but i want it on the interior side so i have changed it here from here you can give the horizontal distance as you can see here so that's what this offset is for and from here you can either flip the design so just keep on using these uh, different commands and then click ok and now you can see that this skirting is visible in the in this wall on the interior side now whenever you will draw the, this wall the skirting will be automatically placed within along with these walls so i have created these walls with uh, uh, i have created the walls for a room and you can see that the skirting is placed on all of the three sides let's go to its 3d view and you can see that the skirting is visible here and you can see that it's detailing it is uh, perfectly joined at the corners 
Now let's say I want a completely different profile for the exterior as well. So again, click on edit type, go to the preview, go to the vertical section, click on edit, then click on sweep to open this dialog box. And now let's add another profile. So here I have, I want a simple rectangular profile. So I have selected this one and which is built in. So you can see that it is placed on the exterior side of the wall. And from here you can change the material and anything you wish for and either you want to give it an offset or, or not. And you know you can see that the skirting is placed on the outer on the exterior side of the wall as well. And if you place the door within this wall, the skirting is cut automatically. So that's a plus point as well. So you can see that how easy it is to create and place a skirting in the Revit project files. I hope you like this tutorial and if you have any kind of difficulty, you can ask me anytime. I will meet you guys in the next video. Till then, goodbye and take care. And most importantly, don't forget to like, share and subscribe.